Shalom and welcome back to the Light to the Nations uh, channel. Finally, we got to the end of this month, the end of the this year. Um, is the day 30th of the 12th month according to the scripture calendar. And tomorrow is the four intercalary day where the year is completed. So, you know, I have everything set up and I want to share with you uh, the sundial and what I'm what I'm what I'm doing now in terms of the measurement of uh, today. Uh, I was blessed to to get a place where to install the the sundial. It's a very beautiful place outside the city. Uh, so here I have with all the sounds and songs of the birds and with the calm of the of the nature. So it's really, really nice to, to, to be here. And, and before that, I want to thank you, all of you, for your prayers. Uh, as I told you in my last video, uh, <clears throat> it's been a little bit difficult to, to be here today, getting the, the measurement of the sundial. Tomorrow is going to be <clears throat> something similar, but at least uh, thank you, thanks to your prayer and thanks for Yahuwah for sure. I'm able to be here uh, being witness once again, one additional year. It's going to be the third year after uh, after discovering the truth of the calendar of Yahuwah that I'm able to, to witness the movement of the luminaries. <clears throat> so... Uh, I really thanks all of you for for your prayers and being with me on this uh, on this journey. You know, uh, none of us is the owner of the truth, uh, and none of us is a teacher. Uh, we are just uh, followers of the Rabbi. We are followers of the truth and the way. And as I have been always uh, sharing with you, my intention of these videos is not to try to become uh, a rabbi, a pastor, a teacher, none of that. I'm a person, a follower like you are, just sharing my journey with you, sharing the light that I'm receiving uh, from Yahuwah, because there is a lot of birehot, uh, a lot of blessings, every time that you share something with somebody else. And I'm witness of that as well, because I have experienced that blessing in my own life. So let me turn a little bit the camera, so I will show you the sundial. I know that the sounds is not going to be that good now, but I will try to speak louder. So sorry for the a little bit the, of the disorder and mess a little bit here, but this is the sundial, <clears throat> you know. I have been attended so, so well here that I, even I got some breakfast. So sorry for that because I have a sandwich and the, and the coffee over there uh, on top of the sundial. But this is, is just to make the, the experience a little bit more comfortable. So this is the sundial. You know, yesterday I, I was uh, setting this up. Uh, it's the same one that I, I used last year. You can you can check it with the, with the last video. And, and you know, I already set it, set it up in order to for this second sundial to to point to the north. Actually, I was working on the um, on the on the inclination, so it's already set up in the proper incl inclination according to the latitude and altitude of this place. And let me show you a little bit here. You know, I, I built this sundial very, very tall in order to to be able to 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 have more and more options to 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 get the shallow. You know, sometimes the trees actually here I have some some few trees uh, doesn't allow to 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 get all the shallow all the time. So that's why I built it uh, somehow tall. So. <clears throat> You know, yesterday I was the checking was the true north. Uh, if you have some some doubts about uh, what I'm talking about, last year I, I, I uploaded a video about how to find the true north. So yesterday I, I was doing it. And I was in a rush yesterday. I couldn't measure the the, the one and a half hour before and after as as, as is recommended. 
but at least I could uh, do something in a range of uh, two hours, approx. And, and and that was the, those were the measurement yesterday in order to discover the true north. So based on that, I, I put this line over here that you can see. They say it's gonna be a reference line uh, that I'm gonna use for the looking for the straight line as I have been doing in the last two years. And, and you know, I already put some measurements uh, according to the shadow that I saw today. Uh, this is what I started to see the, the shadow at 9.05 uh, today. You see that it's um, uh, still not on this uh, reference line. Again, as I told you, this is going to be a reference line because at the end the most important thing to do, as uh, in the previous years, is just to look for the straightforward by joining all the all the um, all the marks that I'm going to put today and tomorrow. Okay. And, and here we see, let me show you the, sorry for that, there is focus, it's still out of, uh, of the line. So I will keep measuring this during the day, I will see what's the, um, what's the, the situation. I have some company over here. So, um, um, <laughs> So, so you know, they, we need to see. Uh, we need to see what's the the situation for sure. Today is not the 364 day of the year, uh, so for sure it's not the equinox according to the revelation of Henoch, the the, the book of Enoch. But uh, it's important to have some measurements today and tomorrow, as has been doing it in the um, in the last uh, few years. Uh, in this other sundial, let me move a bit. Um, so the idea of this sundial is that uh, we will need to see the shadow of the, the two strings uh, in the middle of the sundial. That there I have the marks. So most probably this will need a little bit of adjustment. I will see today at solar moon was the was the results, and that's why I have all the squares and the uh, and the. Um, and the professional level here that I have been using in the past in order to make sure that this is properly uh, set up. Uh, you know, this is not a exact science, but it's important to try to make it uh, uh, as exact, exact as possible. And let me turn the camera again so you can see me. Uh, because uh, because every 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 change, a little change, is changing somehow the the measurement. So that's why it's important to try to to put it as exact as possible in order to have the proper measurement of the of the of the shallow and the movement of the sun. So that's from for now. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna use the um, the opportunity that that I have to be here in this place in order to record few additional videos. I told you that I'm planning to talk about the the signs, planning to talk about the moon that is gonna be really important this year, uh, and actually every year is important, but uh, this year is, is is more than important because of the because of the of this. Uh, of the cycles and the revolution every 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 three years according to the revelation in the book of Hanoch, Enoch. Um, and also I want to talk to you about the, the intercalation. So again stay tuned. Thank you for watching the, the video and being with me uh, from your locations. I know that we are in the dispersion but I I I feel that you all of you are with me in this place through the Ruach Hakodesh. So thank you again. Shalom, all of you, and Yahuwah be with you. Bye.